Now we're going to, we've finished uh, dribbling and receiving and controlling the ball. Now we're going to start moving into the technique of shooting. What's different about uh, shooting is that the focus on shooting is really directing the ball, whether it's out of the air or on the ground, with force toward a target. And so just getting that mindset of being able to strike the ball firmly with a solid ankle and making strong contact on the ball is something we really want to build toward. And so we'll start by doing what are called volleys. And a volley is when you're striking the ball out of the air as it's coming towards you. And we'll start with the inside of the foot volley, which is very similar to the inside of the foot pass along the ground, except the ankle is firm, the ball's coming in the air, and I'm gonna volley it right back to Logan out of the air. And it's just developing that technique of being able to hit the ball as it's coming at me with force back to a target. So Logan, pick up inside the foot volley right back to you. I come toward the ball, I volley the ball back to Logan, and I'm gonna try and hit the ball right back to him in the air. So I'm gonna reach out, pop it right back to him, okay? okay. Inside the foot, I pop it right back to him. Okay. By being able to hit it right back at the same level that it came at, I have to hit it perfectly. So I'm hitting right in the middle of that ball each time. Right in the middle of the ball so it goes right back. That type of precision is what's required to be a good shooter of the ball, okay? Okay? okay. And both feet. Okay. It's coming back at the same level. And my body's always moving with the ball right back toward the target all my way, okay? All the players get right on this code. And we'll probably need these backup balls in case they don't go straight. I just want you to just a little bitty jog toward me. Volley it right back to my hand. Inside the foot. Next player. Perfect. Next player. Good. Pop it right back to my hands. Good. Right back to my hands. Nice. Come up. Very nice, Quint. Good. Try to keep it up, Ian. Very good. Good. Concentrate. Keep it going. Three in a row, Quinn. Nice, Ian. Perfect. Left. Good, Nelson. Left. Woo, good. Left. Here we go, Quinn. Woo, yeah. Left. All right, good. Okay. Logan by himself right here with the ball. You guys step back where you were. So that is inside of the foot volley. Now, we're progressing to the part of the foot that you're going to use most often in shooting, which is the instep, the top of the foot where your shoestrings are. We started with hunt and catch, toe pointed, ankle lock. This is going to be a one-time volley out of the air with my instep right back to Logan. I approach it, right back where it was, okay? I can approach it, both feet. I'm lifting my leg up, my knees over the ball, my toes down, volley it right back to where it came from. Yep. Again. Okay. Thank you. All the players here. So this is in step, volley, toe down, ankle lock, follow through. Your body's over the ball. You're not hitting it. You're not punting it like a goalie. So you're leaning forward, knees over the ball, control it, go. Good. Good try. Here it is, perfect. Good. Lock that ankle a little stronger. Good. Right to me. Good try. Good. Good. There we go. Up, lift it up a little bit. Perfect. Good, Logan. Bad throw, sorry. Good. Shin ball. Oh. Old man catch. Good. Good. And one more. Nice. All right. Good. So that's inside the foot volley and in step volley. Okay. Now we'll set up for some shooting.
we have progressed to the point now where we're going to finish up with some shooting. And I'll demonstrate now the proper shooting technique, and then I'll run the players through a simple one touch, a two touch shooting first, and then one touch shooting. Again, it's only for demonstration that I'm going to be showing the technique of shooting while the ball is stationary. All the shooting that we do in practice, obviously all the shooting that happens in games, is all happening with the ball moving. And so that's why when we move to a drill, I'll demonstrate the ball in motion. But just so that players can see the proper shooting technique, I'll do it from a stationary ball right now. And I'll do it from behind. So if the target is out that way where Coach Scott is, the shooting technique is going to be where I'm going to be coming up over the ball like this, the non-shooting foot is alongside the ball. I'm arching back. I'm using the same locked angle, toe pointed down, and knee over the ball that I did on the driving. But what's really I'm going to focus on with the players all throughout, it's very difficult, is to land on the foot that I'm hitting the ball with. It's very unnatural, but it's the key to being able to shoot with accuracy and power when the players are older. And so I'm going to come up to the ball and I'm going to just very, much, very slow now, concentrate on following through with the foot that I shoot with. You let go, Scott. So you notice that my toes pointed down. I'm following through all my bodies over the ball, all my weights moving forward, and I'm landing on my right foot, I'm landing on my shooting foot. And notice the accuracy, notice how low it's going, and the power that I'm getting without swinging that hard. So if I really concentrate on the proper technique, I'll get good power, I'll land on that shooting foot. Now, I have taught this technique to most of the players here, so hopefully what I'll do is we'll do a two-touch shooting drill where I'll play the ball, the player will settle it, push one touch forward, the second touch will be the shot. Okay? Players, it's a two-touch shooting. I'll tell you when to go. I'll play it to you. It's one touch forward, and then a shot on goal. Concentrate on locking your ankle with your toe down and landing on the foot that you're shooting with, even if it's awkward, OK? I'll have Coach Scott show. I'll do one, OK?
Wait, do you want one more? Sure. All right. One touch shadow and follow through. Oh, good try. Okay. Coaches, when we're practicing shooting, one of the things that I, I do when I'm working with younger players as they're developing their shooting technique is I do a lot of one touch shooting. And the reason is, is that as the ball's coming at the player and they only have one touch to shoot it, they have to use perfect technique or the ball will go in all kinds of different directions. So they'll get immediate feedback as to whether or not they're using the proper technique by whether or not the ball is going in the direction that they'd like it to go. So I'm just going to demonstrate that with our players now. All the shooting technique is the same. The chest is over the ball, the non-shooting foot is pointing to the target, ankles locked, following through, land on the foot you shoot with, all the techniques I just talked about. But now they're only going to get one touch to do it in. One touch shooting. One touch shooting. Use your proper technique. Land on the foot that you shoot with, no matter how awkward it feels. Okay? First up. Very nice. Good try. Coach Scott, I'm getting you to go back to the line. Try it. Point that toe down real strong. That time the chest was a little bit higher and it lifted the ball up. So you can see if they don't get it just right, it won't go in the right direction. Stay over it. Again, that ball is coming off a little bit to the side and leaning back. Focus, Logan. Lock that ankle. Drive right through it with your chest. That's a beautiful one right there. So coaches, just you'll notice that just before Logan shot that ball, I just had him concentrate for a second and just kind of review in his mind. The technique is so precise that if the, uh, if the players aren't fully concentrating, one little thing off and the ball will go in the wrong direction. So sometimes you just need to slow the drill down a little bit have everybody refocus, especially if they're messing around in line. Are you ready yet? Yeah. Focus your mind on what you're doing. Beautiful. Just with that added concentration, the last two shots. Quinn, don't let the ball get off to the side of you. Make sure it stays right in front of you and you run right with it, right toward the goal. See that? That was much better. The ball before was kind of getting on the outside of Quinn, and so he had to kind of reach for it. You want, it, you want the ball to be coming right in front. Everybody gets one more shot, and then we're all finished. Here we go. Good try. Good try, you're okay. Last one, Quinn. Very nice. So we very much appreciate you coming to the website and viewing the fundamentals. Good luck with it. Rewind, replay, practice, practice. Just like anything else in life, any other skill, the more you practice, the more time you spend with the ball, the more mastery you'll have of it. So thank you and good luck for Geneva Lake United Soccer and work hard.